Okay, so you've got bunions and you've had surgery. What can you expect after surgery? A lot of that's gonna depend on what type of surgery was needed to correct your bunion, but in general, there's gonna be a short period of time immediately after surgery where uh, you're gonna use crutches or a walker or a knee scooter, something like that to, te to keep the pressure off of the uh, foot, uh, and then uh, will gradually allow you to put more pressure on the foot after several days once your incisions are healed up. Uh, for most people, the surgery is an outpatient procedure where you can go home the same day and then you basically spend a couple of days just relaxing on the sofa or in bed, keeping your foot elevated. Once you come back to clinic at about five days after surgery, we'll change your dressings and then um, switch you from uh, typically what we call a post-operative shoe, which is just a sandal to allow for lots of uh, room for the dressings into a boot that you can walk on. And for most patients at that point, we'll allow you to start walking on the foot, generally keeping your weight on the heel so that you don't put too much pressure through the front part of the foot. That's gonna last till about six weeks after surgery and then we'll allow you to switch into regular shoes at that point as your swelling and um, comfort allows you to. Uh, on rare occasions, we need to keep the boot going uh, longer than that, but uh, we'll be checking x-rays and seeing you in clinic um, in the weeks after surgery to make sure that you're ready to progress your activities. For most people, full activities are going to resume somewhere around about oh, two and a half to three months after surgery, but you'll continue to see improvement in your symptoms and swelling for several months after surgery. This is Dr. J.P. Elton with Vail Summon Orthopedics, and we'll see you next time.